Guess where we are? We are in Disney World. Today we're at Hollywood Studios. That's where we're starting our trip. Later on today we'll be heading over to the Magic Kingdom. We're starting in Hollywood Studios this time around. Not very busy yet. We got here, we did an overnight flight like we usually do. We got some breakfast and then we got here really early so we're one of the first people in line. Hopefully they'll let us in soon and maybe we can get some Starbucks. When you come to Disney World, rather than having a paper ticket or a card ticket, you have the option to have a magic band. I like the blue one. There's lots of different colors and styles that you can get. And so this actually has my annual pass ticket on it. It knows who I am and I'll use it to get entrance into the park. If I was staying on property, I could also use it to gain entrance to my room at the hotel and I can attach a credit card to it so I can use it to pay for food or merchandise while I'm in the parks as well. This is what you use to get in. So you tap your magic band to the area here. It's not turned on right now. I'll show it to you when it is, but you tap your Mickey on this to the Mickey on that. This will turn green or blue if it's not working for some reason, but it'll turn green. And then this lights up over here and you put your finger on it and it doesn't get your fingerprint. It's actually biometrics. So it takes the shape of your finger and that's how it knows that this band belongs to you. Donald's coming out to entertain the crowd while we're waiting. Hi Donald. How are you? Oh, yes. Oh, good. Yeah, so I, I oh, yes. Can you get a picture with me? Yeah. Yeah. So that's how that works. First ride of the day is Toy Story Midway Mania. And it's definitely busy, busy, busy. But hitting it first thing in the morning is very important because otherwise the wait's gonna be two hours all day long. So check out the crowd for this. Pretty crazy. The idea of Toy Story Midway Mania is that you've been shrunken down to the size of a toy. And that means that everything around you is huge. So you've got the Sheriff Woody playset here. You've got one of those balsa wood flyers, life size. Some Lincoln logs. It's a 3D ride, so you need to get 3D glasses. Very attractive. Here's Calvin in his styling, styling, stylish 3D glasses. Toy Story Midway Mania is a ride as well as a game. You have a little gun here and you shoot uh, various carnival rides. My score is 212,500 and I was a kitty. And nobody was next to me because Josh and Calvin are on the other side of the car. I did not win in the car. Somebody had 227,000. I'm not sure who yet. I'll find out though. The next ride we're going on is the Hollywood Tower of Terror. So it's the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror. There she broke with the key of imagination. Beyond it is another dimension. A dimension of song. A dimension of sight. A dimension of mind. You're moving into a land of both shadow and substance, of things and ideas. You've just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. Hollywood, 1939. Amid the glitz and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right, a beacon for the show business elite. Now, something is about to happen that will change all that. A 
on an evening very much like the one we have just witnessed. Tonight's story of the Twilight Zone is somewhat unique and calls for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. The next ride is Rock and Roller Coaster starring Aerosmith. We're gonna use our fast passes and we're gonna do a single rider line. Wow, all right. Hey, don't mind us, we'll be finished in just a minute. Hey, 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 what are you guys still doing here? You were supposed to be at a show. What now? I'd like to introduce our lovely manager. Yeah, uh, she's oh. usually not like this. Yeah, she's usually worse. I heard that. <laughs> Where is my limo? Good. Okay, come on, guys. Please get in the car. <coughs> Sorry, folks. We gotta go. Come on. Chris, can you grab my blacklist, Paul? Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We can't leave these people here like this. <laughs> we can't? Oh. No. Come on, you know how we feel about our fans. Yeah, yeah that's right. right. Well, guys, what do you expect me to do? Send them all with you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Wait a minute. I love that idea. How about some backstage passes? Oh. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Make it happen. Yeah. Give us some. Okay. Okay, okay. I'll make it happen. Right. Now get out of here. Yeah. I hate all of you. See you. Bye. 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 Bye, Sal. It's me. Listen, I'm going to need a bigger car. Make it a stretch. In fact, make it a super stretch. Great. Hollywood Studios has the most Star Wars stuff out of all four of the parks. There's the Jedi Training Academy plus a stage show. Muppet Vision 3D is a bunch of construction. That is where Star Wars Land is going to be for Walt Disney World. A very large crane. A couple of cranes, actually. Can't exactly tell what they're building there, but you can see construction going on. The Star Wars Land in Disneyland is supposed to be opening this year, I think? But in Disney World, it's not gonna open at least for another year, maybe two. Just got out of Muppet Vision 3D. I love that show, even though it's, what, 30 years old almost. And the fountain's working again. They had it down and was use and they were using it as a planter for a while because they were doing construction in the area, but now the fountain's back. And Goofy's out as well. Hi, Goofy! We're not going to wait in line for him. We have a number of pictures with Goofy, but he is one of my favorites. Tours. The next ride is going to be Star Tours. We have fast passes, but we might do the 40 minute wait first and then use the fast pass. Not just these two, I've got others, but I'm not telling you where. Oh, that's just what you'd like me to do, isn't it? Well, I'm not doing it. Sir, I know what you're up to. I can see right through you, and it's not a pretty picture. Where do these humans get this stuff? Here at Star Tours, we have a very specific boarding process, but I'm not going to tell you what it is. I'm not programmed for that, so keep it moving. Here you go. It's been my pleasure scanning you today. And you. Not you. 
you sure you're not Zagruta because you're coming up orange on my skin? You, uh, look at it. Let's keep it moving, let's keep it close. Stay alert. sci-fi diner and it's set up to look like a drive-in theater so we're sitting in a car there are other cars near us and it looks like we're outside and they show various clips from movies from the 50s time frame pretty cool we're saying goodbye to Hollywood Studios for the trip. There's not enough rides here for us to come back for, so we usually hit it in half a day. Now we're gonna see if we can check in early to our hotel, and then we're going to be going to Magic Kingdom tonight.